Hello, fellows. This is NedRud77. I've heard you guys want to see the dark side of Sonic Adventure 2 battle, so I figured it would be best for Durden77's doppelganger to take you through this, because pff, look at him over there with his little fucking hero story. What a bitch. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and get into this, guys. Story it's time to start the dark story with Shadow the Hedgehog. Wait! Ah, ah, shit! Get out of here, you asshole! Jesus Christ. I thought it'd be a good idea for my twin to take that over since, you know, Dark, Double King, or all this shit, but he's just... Nah, he's gonna be a downer. Hey guys, it's Durden77, and I might be a happy guy, but I like to get dark, so let's do that shit! Let's start it up! This is, in my opinion, the best, the better of the two stories. Um, I'm very excited, very, very, very excited to play this! Let's get this going! Thank you guys so much for your patience. I hope you saw my little update video, and, um... Man, I'll shut up now. Let's get this started. Explosions! Eggman! I'm not gonna shut up! I'm too excited! Light them up, bro. Hell yeah. Mm. They feared it! Yeah, they should've. Ultimate life form. Let's go! All right, so we actually start off with Eggman here. Eggman is the doppelganger of Tails in this game, so this is basically Tails gameplay, but we're Eggman, so it's immediately better because Eggman is awesome. <laughs> so we are busting into this base and trying to find what Eggman's grandfather was working on, and this looks very similar to the jail. Uh, stage with Tails. So similar, in fact, that I think I'm actually gonna go up here and make sure that there's no hidden little bastards in the corner like there were last time. Okay, cool. Awesome. Let's keep on moving. Keep on destroying shit. Man, like, he's causing a lot of damage just with this little mech. Holy shit. Him and Tails, like, the defenses in these places are not built for bipedal mechs with, like, one gun and a rocket. They just can't handle it. Let's do this. Yeah, this looks like the actually like the reverse of Tails' level in a way. Uh, some of the levels you play back through with some characters, but there's definitely some original uh, levels on the dark side too. Um, but yeah, I just I think the story's better. I love villains, as I mentioned before. I'm I'm generally a villain guy. Uh, that's me. I, I of course love my heroes and all all that shit, but. Um, Despite what uh, Nedrud might say, I'm really, really into the dark side. I like it. Always generally prefer villains over heroes in most cases. Um, with some a few exceptions, of course. So, not only is that just fun for me, but I legit think the story's better. I think Shadow's a cool character. Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm just super excited. I'm super excited to see how much of this I remember. I definitely remember this first bit, for sure. Uh... Let's see, let's keep on trucking. There was probably a secret up there, but ah, I feel like I should try to get that right. Can I? No, no, no. <laughs> there was like a branching path that I know I missed so many like power-ups the first playthrough on uh, the hero. I'd like to avoid that this time if I could. I can't go that way. I'm obviously going to need a power-up for that. But I want to check this other area out real quick. Got to Metroid Prime this shit and unlock all this. Let's see. Let's try to let's try to sneak over here if the camera will cooperate with me at all. All right. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. There's a there's a steel box there, so I'm not messing with that. So that looks like something we might not be able to get access to yet. Just try to make sure I don't miss shit this time. But you know what? We got the Chow stream for that anyway. That's really where we're gonna crank this game up to like 18. We're just gonna explore everything and make our Chows as strong as possible. I'm just gonna keep moving for now. Get this fat ass on to the ultimate life form. I do legit love Eggman though. I always have. I, I think he's a great villain. And when he's done right, you know, I mean, that's that's kind of the problem with Sonic stuff is the writing is, uh, let's say hit or miss in a lot of games. But I, I've always liked the writing in Adventure, even though it's it's not. I don't know. I think they do the characters well in these games. Like, I definitely think they do the characters. Oh, no, gorillas! I must try. Thank you. Yes. Um, I think they do the characters really well. Uh, the writing itself might not be that great, but I really like Eggman's portrayal in these adventure games. Um, 
I like shadow, all that stuff. Did I just get speed boots with Eggman? Whoa, watch out, guys, or I'll, I'll, I'll run off this elevator and kill myself at super speed. Ooh, man, jamming. And at least Eggman says, yo, when he kills things, not, okay, that's way better. Um, yeah, I like the character writing in, in this game. Now, you know, I'm recently playing Sonic Colors uh, Ultimate, um, and while there's some cute writing in there, that's that's kind of what I'm saying. It's like, uh, man, these characters can really change depending on who you write for. Eggman's still great in that, don't get me wrong, but um, he, he's trying a little too hard to be funny. Um, my favorite, I, li I like my Sonic with a little bit of edge to it, you know what I'm saying? You know, I like it to be a little edgy, you know, <laughs> I don't want it to be Shadow the Hedgehog edgy, but I don't want it to be like Lost World and Colors, uh, cartoony quite either. Uh, there, I, I like, I like something right in the middle, something like, uh, kind of the, the original Sonic movie, uh, like the animated movie, you know, I think they call him like Junio Sonic or something these days. That, that's the kind of vibe I'm, I'm looking for when it comes to Sonic, and I think Adventure does that really well. I don't know what that rock was about, but I guess we're not going to find out. Oh, I guess we are! Uh, now it's pulsating. Wants the Eggman to touch it. Well, I will. You don't have to tell me twice. Wait, what? Okay, cool. <laughs> I thought it was about to shoot me. Is that really necessary? Are you going to tell me to shoot the rocket? Are you going to tell this, the, yeah, the brilliant scientist to shoot the rocket? Son of a bitch. All right. Yush. <laughs> See, come on. This hop, this yush, everything's a little bit better than Tails. I love you, Tails. Don't get me wrong. I love Mr. Prower, but love me some Eggman, man. I should have tried a little harder. Break D for Durden. You don't have to try that hard. You're pretty good, Eggman. All right. So I think we're going to be introduced for the first time on this side of the story to the main man. Well, Chow world. <laughs> I'm going to at least go dump my animals real quick. Oh, and I get to be Eggman, like, just in the flesh. I forget. This is awesome. This is worth it alone. Look at this shit. Why? Why are you so fast? Why is everyone in Sonic's world so fast? Oh, my God. This is great. I think in my stream, I'm just going to, like, only be Eggman to take care of these precious little, little babies. Yay. Yay. All right. Oh, we didn't bring our gorillas with us, I don't think, because... Ah, shit. All right. Once again, we're saving this for the stream, guys. Sorry. I'm going to go ahead and move ahead and keep the story in. Level 7. I like that level. What we got here? Stomp, stomp, stomp. Oh, no, I mentioned it before, but Eggman's voice actor is, is truly excellent. He's probably the best best overall voice actor in this series. Consistently just excellent. Enter password. Password is Maria. Maria. Place the Chaos Emerald into this console. <laughs> Thank you for giving us that uh, exposition, Eggman. Really appreciate it to yourself. <laughs> Something's happening. <laughs> there he is. I mean, it's very clearly not Sonic. You're not Sonic. This is impossible. Like, do you think all hedgehogs look alike, Egg Eggman? You gotta, got a little bit of a problem, buddy. <laughs> not cool, man. Not cool. Hell yeah! Rocket boots. <laughs> Even though I love the design of, his, of Shadow and the Rocket Boots, I always thought that was kind of funny. Like, I'm the ultimate life form, but I need Rocket Boots to keep up. Like, I don't know. Maybe that's, like, organically a part of him, but yeah. Woohoohoo! All right. Looks like Tom Bigfoot is able to be in two places at once. Oh, wait. So this is before Tom chased me outside. I see. I see your lore now, Tom. You've been places. You've seen things. Okay. 
So he got his ass kicked twice by two different hedgehogs. What? Excuse me? An internet connection is required. I don't know what that is, and now all of a sudden the sound is gone. That is super odd. Uh, I'm really sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm probably going to have to cut it after this then, because yeah, I've never seen that. Why the hell would I need an internet connection to play a game that's like almost 20 years old? Get the fuck out of here with that shit. Hell no. Hell no. And somehow Tom is stronger when I fought him, when I'm fighting him now than I did with with Sonic. You'd think he would have... Ah, whatever. <laughs> anyway... This is nice. No music at all. Fantastic. I hope that we'll be able to hear the music in the cutscene. If not... Oh my god. Tom, you asshole. There we go. Cool, cool. Oh my god. Come on. Come on! What is this? That's so weird. Is this like... Is this like a slowdown revenge type thing? People have been saying his name a lot in the comments, and I feel like that you shouldn't say that, or it'll bring on... Things like this. He's out there somewhere. I know he is. Scheming. Let's see if we can kill Tom and hopefully it lets us see the cutscene properly. Oh my god, Tom might kill me again. Okay, no, no, he didn't. <laughs> there we go! Alright! We are fucking back! That was weird as shit. Maybe that was like Tom's like ultimate attack was just deafening shadow with dial-up internet connection. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Top secret weapon. But what did you mean when you said you will grant me a wish? I am part genie. Did you see the rings? Shadow, I need to sort this shit. I'll be waiting for you in the central control room on the space colony arc. Arc. Mm. We were there. We know what arc is. Yeah, slam that thing again. Be astonished again, Eggman. Desert area. Hey, what's up? The beautiful couple. We've seen this already. Different point of view. Hey, it's like on my necklace, though. That's kind of cool. Very powerful. Man, he got there quick. So he got there extremely quick, but he he leaves like so slowly. <laughs> Once again, you're not mistaken because Knuckles told you everything. Correct. Oh, best way to save the thing I'm trying to protect is to destroy it. Like, why didn't he just punch Eggman? He's not protected at all. He jumped that high. Just jump a little bit higher. Or climb. Just punch the shit out of Eggman with the steel, like, knuckles you have and kill him. No, let's break one of the most precious artifacts in the world instead and go on a worldwide hunt. Bye, Eggman. <laughs> See you whenever you get there. 26 days. Correct. All right, so it looks like it's our first level with Rouge the Bat. It's pretty similar to Knuckles' first level, but as you can see, it's a little different. New coat of paint. Uh, but we're going to stop here, guys. Uh, I'm going to see if I can figure out that. So sorry about that weird internet thing. I, and the weird thing is, like, I'm totally connected to the internet, but whatever. Um, I'm glad it recovered. Anyway, we will be back very soon to get into some bat. Oh, man, they really, those, man. Jesus Christ, Sega, come on now. Physics. Oh my god. <laughs> we'll be back with this. We'll be back with, with this this thing. Uh, who is actually kind of a good character. She's not she's not too bad. She's she's okay. When it comes to Sonic Friends, she's not too shabby. Uh, but thank you guys so much for watching. We will continue the dark story very soon. I will see you shortly. Can I die? Am I able to die here? I think I am! Yay! No! Oh, yeah, just you you stay. Stay, stay under there! Stay! It's tradition! It's tradition! It's tradition! <laughs> Alright, well, it's a tradition that's taking quite a long time. Oh, wait, there it goes! Here we go, we're gonna die. Thank you so much for your patience and watching. Hope to see you very soon, maybe at a premiere. 
three more seconds. I don't think this will be a prayer, but hopefully the next one will be. Bye! And they got a jiggle when she dies, too. Oh, my God.